Welcome to Good Mythical More. Merchicality. <laughs> this is when you wear merch and then we give you more merch. Congratulations to Stephen Graham. Congrats, you win a $30 mythical.store gift card. Ooh. Look at that, ripping it for the whole family. Oh, ooh, NC State, go whoop her. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> he just arsenioed. Yeah, dude. You're gonna dislocate Dog your pound. shoulder doing that. Dog pound, I know. That's, that's why I wanted to All stop. Right, let's bring out uh, Josh and Ellie. There Speaking you. of merch, um, if the tees that are discontinued from mythical.store, many of them we move over to our Amazon store. So check that out, yes. amazon.com slash mythical. Yes, um, see like that hat's discontinued, this one's not. You guys are repping the hats, I love it. Why well, you brought your pocket spoons? I keep spoons in my pocket at all times because you never know when you're gonna need them. Yep. And then I try and sit down in a chair and then it hurts because the spoons. Let's get this <laughs> Oh, I've got yeah. pocket spoons. Uh -huh. Because spoons. Yeah. Okay, so I didn't know that the lava, slide on up. You can slide a the lava sauce and the uh, volcano burrito were discontinued. How, how, mm. how long has that been discontinued? It was a couple months before the fiery oh, Doritos Locos taco debut. Oh, right? yes, basically. Oh, the fiery the Doritos. Mm. They still have that? Because it yes. sort of okay. functioned in the same way, kind of. They were both yeah. bright red, but one of them was like plain bright. The volcano taco was bright red with no flavor, and all the flavor came from the sauce. And then they added mm. a flavorful bright red taco shell, and they couldn't coexist on the menu. Yeah. One was so much better than the other. Also, the Doritos taco shell was like years in the making, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, a lot of science. Mm -hmm. So I actually had to make way for science. Really. I went to the midnight premiere of the Doritos Locos Taco. <laughs> oh, that is there a was real a movie. Thing. No, no, uh, they premiered it at midnight, midnight. at uh, select Taco Bells that I believe you can only find out about if you're a member of the Facebook group. Make taco shells out of Doritos. That's that the name it. of the group. When Facebook groups just had like demands yeah, as a yeah, name, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And I was part of it because that's what started yeah, the whole thing. Cool. It was yeah, user demand. Yeah, and so uh, I went to it, and it was a really great time. There's like four people on the cheesy core yeah. Facebook group, right? Yeah, I'm three of them. <laughs> All right, so what do what do to, what do we have here? So we recreated the lava sauce, which was genuinely really awesome, and a lot of people think it's just a mixture of nacho cheese and fire sauce. But if you look at the actual ingredients in it, um, it, everything basically starts with egg yolks and oil in the ingredients list, which lets you know it's a mayonnaise-based sauce. Okay. Like so many of Taco Bell's oh, are. Oh, dang. So this is a uh, what, dang. jalapeno what mean, and cheddar cheese mayonnaise. flavored mayonnaise, essentially. You don't like mayonnaise? Jalapeno no, like and cheddar cheese flavored mayonnaise. That's more or less what it was, and it was pretty spicy. So, but if you want to do it to your, yourself at the this, at this actual location now, the best people are coming up with is mixing Nacho cheese with fire sauce. I would say take a little bit of the creamy jalapeno and mix that in. Do an equal blend of all three. Fire, creamy jalapeno, there and nacho go. cheese. You heard it here. Maybe a splash of the Diablo sauce. All right, do you want to cut this? Uh-huh. I'll do Ellie, it. Ellie, you do it. I'll do it. Oh, look, it's Josh's fancy chef knife that he doesn't usually let me use. <laughs> it was one time. Wow. It was <laughs> just just one chicken time. and she was using it. And I Actually, someone walked. else did it. Uh, someone else did it. I go it. into the writer's room it's like, who used this knife? Uh, <laughs> It was Micah. Do I so. go back and forth or do I just slice down? This is why I don't let people use the knife. Back and forth or slice down? Just back and forth until you get to like a certain point and then you can slice. Also, if you want to tuck your fingers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tuck those yeah. fingers. Tuck them? <laughs> yeah, if you want to like kind of like tuck the fingers in because like. That way you won't slice them <laughs> off. Yeah. Wow. That's good though. Look at. Ooh, okay, look so at this her. is the fire. What do you, what, what do you call her. this? This is the volcano burrito. So it's. You calling that a her? Crunchy red strips, which mm -hmm. after sitting in a burrito just turn into red strips. Yeah. Um, uh, beef, nacho cheese, uh, lava sauce, wow. and rice. She's beautiful. And then we have just the recreated lava sauce right there. Uh, Link, you got me that <laughs> bag of chips. <laughs> yeah, so man. You're supposed to dip the burrito into the well, lava sauce. There's a lot of lava, lava sauce lava. in the burrito, but if you guys want to just try Smell it at. the lava sauce by itself, it I'm spicy. pretty proud of it. Okay, I'm going straight lava sauce. Now, Ellie, you don't like spicy. Oh, yes, but I've made a lot of uh, improvements lately. I've been working on it, I've been pushing through, and so I'm interested to see how this goes for me. Were you hypnotized? No, I wasn't hypnotized, just like good old fashioned Midwestern like heartiness. Hey, cool. hey, do you guys want a hey. fact? Yeah, I want facts. So the whole volcano menu was discontinued in late 2012. 
And Alex, <laughs> do, do you have? Is, there, is this a conspiracy <laughs> theory? I was like, I mean, because, do you remember the end of 2012? Whoa. The world almost ended. It's got some. Ca- 2013, the yeah. sauce, the sauce disappeared. Okay, I'm dipping. Yeah, me too. I'm double dipping. Oh, and the Doritos Locos Taco would have been late 2011. Also, the original nacho cheese. I believe. You want milk? Correct. Yeah, no, thank you. I have milk. I'll say that the sauce on the chip was a lot for me. Yeah, it was hot, man. But I'm in for this. That is so good. Oh, you're, you're hearty Midwestern, whatever you said mm. you were. Your jaw just popped wicked. I know. You okay? No, I have TMJ from stress, so thanks. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, YouTube fam. Mm-hmm. Sorry. No, um, it's like not even work stress. It's just like stress, stress. Okay, let's talk about it. Yeah. On Saturday. I just um, feel like I hold anxiety <laughs> and like... Thank you to the one In your jaw. In, in my jaw, and specifically when I sleep, I, I grind. Well, the best way to get rid of that is to eat really hot food. Okay. Have you, uh, have you, have you ever oh, tried gosh. wearing Hold a on. grinder? That's a, that's, a, that's a healthy bite she just took. <laughs> right. Ride the fire, Ellie. Because it's already hot in the thing, huh? <laughs> yeah, the mayonnaise kind of binds the rice in there. It's really it's good, though. It's so tasty. It's so tasty. Mm, you guys Why are talking is the smack milk lukewarm? On the biscuit taco, mm. I actually camped out at 4 a.m. before the launch of the biscuit taco. And You're that guy. And live tweeted it. No one what asked you to do that. No, that would have been 2013. What type of things are there to there live tweet from a biscuit? There was a, a heavy Camp smell off. of bleach coming through, and there was a lot of. I really tried to go kind of literary fiction with I it. I think they killed a man. But um, a funny thing is, literary I went fiction. in, and the employees had no idea about the biscuit taco. There was only a sign on the outside of the Taco Bell, <laughs> not on the inside. So I had to like walk one out and be like, "Can I have that, please?" And they were discussing in Spanish amongst themselves. And I heard one say empanada. And they said, "Oh, empanada de pollo, a chicken empanada." So that's what they called their chicken biscuit taco. And I was like. This kind of is an empanada. Woo! In a way. It was really good. I liked it. It was the right item, though. Woo! Yeah, it they was. They didn't yeah. know it was launching. Woo! Yeah. I'm finishing the whole thing. No one else was camped out, either. <laughs> Needless to say. No one in the comments can call me. <sighs> That's good. I like it. I like the mm. burn. I like the burn. Really but good. my dentist <gasps> my dentist told me to... You gonna vomit? No. <laughs> my to, mouth to has so much seat. saliva in it, though. Well, swallow it. That's the good part. But if I swallow it, it also brings more spicy down. Yeah. Take the spice it down. Take it down. Um, I'm just eating the chip with nothing on it to help with that. Is it helpful? It's very good. I mean, since spiciness kind of triggers me mm. at a like a on a physical, I get a physical response now. What type of physical response? Uh, just nausea, mm. if not hiccuping. Mm. So, um, because of the nasty hot stuff we've eaten on the show. I mean, that's a testimony to this thing actually being good because I think it still tastes good. It's not too hot. And I also wear a mouth guard every night. For the Mm. grinding? Yeah, I grind my teeth. I call it I call it the real I call it my grinder. Wow. I really do. Like I forgot my grinder. Gotta get out of bed and go get it. It's a term for something else too. I grind my teeth. Oh, it's like a sub sandwich in the Midwest. Mm Mm-hmm. It actually is a way to break up anti grinder. Mm No, I grind it. I grind it down as I sleep. Instead of my teeth. If you're if you if you It doesn't stop you from grinding. If you've really got anxiety, you'll go through, you know, like a mouth piece, bunch of grinders, a mouth guard within six months. Yeah. You guys both use them? Mm-hmm. Do they work? Oh, you have one? Yeah. Yeah, they, they share the one. same one. Gross. Yours goes on the top or the bottom? Goes on the top, but I have to like pop it in so it's it's supposed to reset the way that my like teeth are clenched. Oh, so that's that something else. It's like in a different. No, it's not like a retainer. It's just like. So because my teeth are clenched down, that's why I get the pot. And then if I reset the way that my, like, they like settle on each other. Let's keep talking about this. So what's your jaw health regimen? (laughs) Your hair and lips aren't doomed. They may just need to be groomed. Try our mythical grooming products available now at mythical.store.